As he was returning home, my father came to a castle. Inside was a cage with a golden nightingale. The castle seemed abandoned, so my father decided to take the bird. Poor thing. I'm going to take you home to my daughter. Daughter, for stealing my nightingale, you will give me your daughter. My father ran as fast as his feet would carry him. He made it to the shore and began rowing for his very life. But just when he thought he was safe... You have time until midnight. A small ring landed at his feet. Hello, my dear. I brought you a present. This is a magical nightingale. Its song will make plants grow, blossom, and bear fruit. I'm very tired from my journey. Perhaps... Ah, uh, Dorian, I hardly know where to begin. When I ended up in a strange castle, I found there the magic nightingale. No one was around, so I thought I was saving the bird when I took it. But then, a terrible monster appeared. I tried to drop the cage, but it was as if it had become attached to my arm. The monster was furious and demanded my daughter in return for stealing his nightingale. If she won't go to him, I must go to serve him forever. If no one arrives at his castle by midnight, I will die. I can't let my daughter go to that monster. I'll use this ring to travel to his castle, but first, I need some sleep. You heard our conversation, didn't you? And now, I suppose you want to go to that monster in your father's place. Well, it's very noble of you, but I won't help you find the ring. <sighs> you know how I feel about you. I don't want you to go.
You can't disturb your father. He's sleeping. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. 